Hello and welcome to my Dragon Age Inquisition trophy run, where I have to get every single trophy in this game in one playthrough. So currently, I'm going through the Stone Coast, and since last time, I looked through the trophy list and had a bit of a scare because of the Recruit and Ally trophy that is connected to the storyline, and I was worried that my imported world state from the keep would actually prevent me from getting this trophy. But after some research, I realized that uh, one should be able to make the story choices that lead up to the trophy. So now let's finish up the storm post and move on to recruiting the last companion. The Hanged Man, actually. Probably been 20 years now. It was a dive, if I remember correctly. It's THE dive, filled with the best and worst people in the world. Yes, I heard it was a haunt of yours. Haunt? Ah, it was home. This belongs to the Wardens. Good find. Wardens must have moved on. They're searching for someone. On Warden business, maybe? Secret missions or whatever it is they get up to when there's no blight. Whoever the Wardens are seeking, he's led them away from here.
This might be a decent place for a spot of camping. about who attacked them and why. Who cares? The Chantry declared them heathens. An attack was just a matter of time. The most holy is dead. Until a divine says you to, I intend to supply the Inquisition. They need our help.
Now open in Val Royale, the wares of my kin imported from as far as the Hunter Horns. The Inquisitor? My, my. Welcome. Relatives in Denerim, they saw, and one walks among us. Exciting and alarming. Slaves to the highest kings, those who bring harm without provocation to the least of his children. Creator, judge me whole. Find me well within your grace. Touch me with fire that I... Tell me I have suffered. Disaster is what it is, and you know it. Theirs were not the only houses affected by the loss of heaven. The land is only part. The girl has run off to the Inquisition. Better than dying to her here. Your Worship, we've seen a marked increase in those wishing to join the Inquisition.
smile and work. Don't need attention while I'm already on the gallop. We have tracked her, and now the group has run off as well. Something about cousins getting wet. Is this a shop? Uh, I maintain a premises wherein customers of a certain affluence entertain the purchase of my ware. So yes, a uh, shop. Don't you mean wares? No, I mean ware. I have one item available for purchase. It is far too expensive for it merely to be sold. You may gaze upon it and dream of the wealth required to possess it and kings, and then you may leave and purchase things from shops more aligned with your station. I'll have you know that I'm the Inquisitor. Of course you are. I am. Hmm. And at this moment you are just as important as any other dreamer who enters my boutique. And just as deserving. Well, goodbye then. Yes. You must control yourself in front of the worshippers, sister. They posed the question, and it is valid. Does the power of this Corypheus suggest the old gods are real? Their reality and power were never in question. It is their nature His nature. Oh yes, I am going to purchase that item. Just a bit later. Uh, work.
Vandras Day. How much did you expend with discovery? It must have weakened the Inquisition immeasurably. I don't know who you are. Don't play games, Inquisitor. Corypheus will break you again and again. He cannot be denied. Just say what? What is that? <laughs> Squishy one, but you heard me, right? Just say what? Rich tits always try for more than they deserve. Blah, blah, blah! Obey me, arrow in my face. So, you followed the notes well enough. Glad to see you're... You're kind of plain, really. All that talk, and then you're just... person. I mean, it's all good, isn't it? The important thing is, you glow. You're the herald thingy. Some believe I'm the Herald of Andraste. But who are you, and what's this about? No idea. I don't know this idiot from manners. My people just said the Inquisition should look at him. Your people? Elves? <laughs> no. People, people. Name's Sarah. This is Cover. Get round it. For the reinforcements. Don't worry. Someone tipped me their equipment shed. They've got no breaches. really came through with that tip. No breaches. <laughs> so, Lady Inquisitor, you're interesting. I'd like to join. Could we take a few moments for sense to reassert itself? Who are you people? I'm not people, but I get what you want. It's like this. I sent you a note to look for hidden stuff by my friends. The friends of Red Jenny. That's me. Well, I'm one. So is a fence in Montfort, some woman in Kirkwall. There were three in Starkhaven, brothers or something. It's just a name, yeah? It lets little people, friends, be part of something while they stick it to nobles they hate. So here, in your face, I'm Sarah. The friends of Red Jenny are sort of out there. I use them to help you. Plus arrows. The Inquisition has spies already. Can you add to these professionals? Here's how it is. You important people are up here, shoving your cods around. Blah, blah, I'll crush you. I'll crush you. Mm -hmm. Ooh, crush you. <clears throat> then you've got cloaks and spy kings, like this tit. Or was he one of the little knives, all serious with his little knife? All those secrets, and what gave him up? Some houseboy who don't know shite, 
but knows a bad person when he sees one. So no, I'm not knifey shiv dark, all hidden. But if you don't listen down here too, you risk your breaches. Like those guards? I stole their... Look, do you need people or not? I want to get everything back to normal. Like you. Back there, you wanted to know if I glowed. Why? That's what you do, innit? You walked out of somewhere, and now you glow. Andraste's Herald. True or not, it seemed like the easiest way to know it was you. True or not? Well, that's what they say on all. Look, don't get ahead yet. I want to help this... whatever it is. Inquisition. You sound like a thief who acts out petty revenge fantasies. And that might be bad. Oh, right. You want to prop that guy up so I can say my sorries? Bad things should happen to bad people. We find someone not so bad, maybe he'll end up not so dead. Good enough? You say that like it's obvious, but you didn't know him. I knew about him. That's just rumor. Look, I'd have been fine stripping his guards and nicking his stuff. Turns out he deserved worse. Or was him trying to kill you a good thing? Are you the baddie? Didn't think so. All right, Sarah. I can use you and your friends. Yes! Getting good before you're too big to like. That'll keep your breaches where they should be. Plus extra breaches because I have all these... You have merchants who buy that piss, yeah? Got to be worth something. Anyway, Skyhold. See you there, Inquisitor. This will be grand. And there goes the trophy for collecting all the companions. Actually, the difficult part here is not uh, collecting them, it is uh, keeping them. <coughs> With the trial on. With the uh, trial on, they have uh, their approval rating doubled, meaning that you can actually lose them very easily. And you have to maintain the entire crew all the way up to the Empress's ball. So now that we have everyone, I should uh, improve their approval rating. In other words, uh, do some of their quests. Vivian, I think, is dangerously low. Like, one disapproves and she'll probably trigger the leave conversation. I actually like that this uh, rating is hidden. This way, you don't just look at statistics and uh, play the game the way you like. Well, about time you came around to talk, innit? Sign me up, then not so much as a welcome. Little busy, I hope, making sure this new place can keep out a pissing archdemon. And the thing controlling it, that we're hunting. Draste, what does step in? I have apparently been through a lot. But yes, Corypheus was a surprise. No, a surprise would be, oh, I stepped in dog shite. No one says, Oh, a Magister God Monster, I'm surprised. Impossible things aren't surprises. The ancient thing trying to kill us seems pretty real. Don't get me started. Oh, wait, too late, right? A Magister who cracked the Black City. It's a hazy dream, right? I mean, if it's real, real, then the seat of the Maker? Real thing. A seat needs a book, so the Maker? Real thing. Fairy stories about the start and end of the world. Real things. It's too far, isn't it? 
I just want to plug the sky hole rubbish so I can go play. You joined to help the little people caught up in this. But do you believe or not? In Andraste? Of course. But you doubt what you're seeing and hearing? It can't be true, true. Even fanatics don't want to be this right. Look, I have arrows. I can make this Corypholus believe in those. Good enough? Please be good enough. Keep calling it nonsense. That perspective will keep the Inquisition grounded. Oh, I can do that. Sure could use a few more people shouting no. We fight, the bad things go away, everyone calms down, and everything goes back to normal. A nice, well-paid normal. You're starting to not sound completely crazy. I know, scary, innit? So bring them on. But first, food. I'm starving. Spiderwebs help stop the bleeding, and they prevent wounds from getting infected. So, that Tevinter guy sent you into the future? Uh. Every time I think I understand magic, the rules change. And you're a mage, so that's saying something. Inquisitor, huh? Well, you've got the fortress for it. Speaking of which, when you've got a second, there's something I want to show you. What did you want me to come see? Here, come on. I'll show you. Why am I dressed like this? You'll see. Come on, it'll be worth your time. I promise. Evening. Iron Bull. My merc band just joined up. Tanner. I'm from Jader. Well, near Jader. Mira. I was gap captain for Lady Pendel. Signed on after shit blew up at the Conclave. Share a drink? Who's your friend? This is Grim. She doesn't talk much. Huh. So. You ready to kill some demons, or Venatori, or whatever that Corypheus asshole is? This isn't just about killing. We're helping the Inquisitor save the world and build the next empire. Hmm. Well, long as I get paid, I'm happy. That's why I signed up. I just couldn't spend my whole life on a farm. Needed to live a little, you know. What about you, Mira? Why'd you join up? I thought you were serving some noble. I saw what happened at Haven. The Inquisitor staring down that monster and his archdemon. I don't think the chant of light as much as I should. But you can't see something like that and not believe. Well, Grim and I should find our tents. Thanks for the drink. I know every soldier under my command. You don't have that option, but a few faces might help. You made it sound like you didn't like the Inquisition. People don't always tell the truth when you're polite. You've got to poke them a bit. But those two soldiers might think you're an asshole. So? I knew some of the soldiers felt like that, but to actually hear it... It's hard to be just an idea sometimes. That's all you are to most of them. It's why you could stand right in front of them without being recognized. You've got a good army coming along. Remember that, no matter what comes next. Well, I hope. What's been going on? 
Seeker Cassandra came through here, looking like a storm cloud. That's just her face, though, isn't it? Take care. What is it? Do you have any advice for me? Treat Dorian with caution. It's possible he could be what he seems, a Tevinta mage wishing to do better than his countrymen. What if he is not? At best, his presence makes the Inquisition appear to have questionable allies. May I ask you about the Chantry? It is difficult to say what becomes of the Chantry now. They have no Templars, no leadership, and no one left who is worthy of succeeding the Divine. It has fallen apart when everyone needs it the most. I ache to think what this will mean in the days to come. Will the Chantry replace Divine Justinia? They will try. Once the priests withdraw for the Grand Consensus, it is against Chantry law for them to emerge without naming a new Divine. Sometimes it takes days, or weeks, or even months. The problem now is that no clear successor to Justinia exists. All worthy clerics died with her at the Conclave. So what happens if they can't agree on someone? Theoretically, they will argue until exhaustion takes them or they see reason. Practically, however, if the Grand Consensus goes on too long, the Chantry will crumble. Any cleric with ambition but little sense will see this as her one chance, and plenty of such clerics exist. We shall see what happens. The Inquisition must act in the meantime. Do you really believe the Chantry is worth preserving? If you ask my opinion, it is. Absolutely. Cast the Chantry aside and new problems replace old ones. We will have learned nothing from history. The people need stability, and the Chantry needs a new purpose. Andraste had a dream for us. It can still be achieved. So, what should this new purpose be? A dedication to what is truly important. Instead of building cathedrals and sewing gowns for the divine, the Chantry used to spend its coin feeding the poor. If we are to spread the Maker's word across the world, we must do so with open hearts and open hands. That sounds rather idealistic of you. Does it? I do not think it's so unachievable. The Chantry has many good, honest people. They just need direction and inspiration. They need to be freed from centuries of adherence to tradition and ceremony. A chance for renewal is at our fingertips. It does not have to come with utter chaos. Thank you. Something you want? You apparently have a lot of friends. Tell me about your network. It's not mine, right? I mean, it is, but it's also everyone. Everyone who wants to shove it to nobles who hide behind gold and silk. And hats, I guess. Is Red's Jenny real? Or was she always just you and your friends? Don't know. Don't you care? Not if it works. I mean, Red is scary because blood. And Jenny is... Look, nobody fears the bunch of people who do random stuff. And besides, it's easy. Nobles want a bogeyman because they need to believe normal people can't get at them. Numbers, right? It don't have to be so complicated. It seems like it should be more complicated than that. That's why you be bad at it, and why I'm here. If you don't want to play, don't play. That's simple, too. Are you just about pranks and revenge, or is there more to it? 
Well, it's a weave, right? I grease the ballroom, so a wyvern chasing git has to hunt spring. Strangely, handmaids leave his vault open. His heirlooms pay off someone else. Maybe clean streets in Kirkwall so someone gets something else. Pish, pish, pish. A lot of people eventually get help or a laugh. Or maybe someone dead, if they deserve it. I'm glad I met you before someone decided what I deserved. You're no hateful ass so far. I'd just get you with a pie or something. Anyway, assassin's a bard's job, innit? No fun, that lot. They might plonk a noble, right? But only to raise another. Plus, I'm shy at singing. We'll talk another time. It's all good, innit? Inquisitor. First, a full wheel of Antivan smart cheese, and now three royals worth of crushed mint. They were right here. I remember seeing someone take them. I just... I can't recall their... F Okay, I want to sit in judgment, but this usually leads to <coughs> huge, uh, to greatly disapproves or approves ratings from almost all the other characters. Wherever so, they are. I'm going to avoid uh, the judgments for now. report no signs of danger in the pass nearby. I will arrange patrols to ensure it stays that way.
see what we have. All right. The soldiers. And that is about all the time there is for this episode. Thank you for watching and until next time when I go to the Fallow Maya.